This week, we highlight another life well lived. Just before 8 o'clock on a December Sunday morning in 1941, U.S. Navy Quartermaster Lou Conter heard planes buzzing overhead as he manned the main deck of the USS Arizona, an American battleship moored at Pearl Harbor in Hawaii. A surprise Japanese attack was underway on a day that would change the world. We have witnessed this morning a severe bombing of Pearl Harbor. At 8.09 on that morning of December 7th, an armor-piercing bomb dropped into the Arizona, setting off massive explosions of gunpowder and ammunition below deck. Conter was thrown to the ground, but well enough to tend to the wounded, rescuing fellow sailors and Marines for more than 30 minutes before the command was given to abandon ship. 1,177 Americans died on the Arizona that day. Conter was one of only 335 who survived. After the attack, he went to Navy flight school and flew some 200 combat missions during World War II, earning the Distinguished Flying Cross. Lieutenant Conter continued as a pilot in the Korean War, where he served as an intelligence officer. Conter joined the Navy after his high school graduation in 1939 and was aboard the Arizona by January of the next year. He was uncomfortable with his reputation as a hero, reminding the public on his annual visit to the USS Arizona Memorial that the heroes died on the ship. They gave the ultimate their life for the United States, and everybody should remember that. Lieutenant Commander Lou Conter, who had been the last living survivor of the attack on the USS Arizona, died on Monday at home in Grass Valley, California. He was 102 years old. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.